So, uh, John 5, 44. How can you believe since you accept glory from one another, but don't seek the glory that comes from God? And I think we pass over this verse too much. Um, listen, how can you believe what your heavenly father says about you when you get fathered by this world, when you get fathered by what other people think about you or what you think about yourself? Because when we talk about man uh, and the glory of man, you're included in that. So it's all people plus yourself. If you get defined by what other people say, think, feel, whatever, act about you or yourself, then you can't believe. Because our Father, who's unseen, says that you're loved, says that you're worth it, says that you're valuable. But Jesus so clearly, John 5, 44 says, how can you do it? It's no wonder, he says. It's obvious. You can't accept what the your heavenly Father speaks, the word of blessing over your life. If you, it's like oil and water, you guys, the two don't mix. If you're concerned with the affairs of this world, if you're concerned and you take in a fathership from this world, then you'll be of this world. Then you're made of this world and this world passes away. So thus you pass away. But if you get made by your father who's unseen, then when this shell crumbles, you're still there. You're still strong. You're still built up. When we pass on into the other life, you've learned how to walk. I think we need to pay more attention to John 5, 44. How can you believe if you accept glory from one another? You're loved and your precious treasure. It's just the word for the day. Take care.